filming this um, earlier not like our usual Facebook live so yeah. please don't hesitate to comment on the comments mm -hmm. um, and yeah we're back again with volumes 34 through 36 of One Piece mm -hmm. we're still going strong we still love the story mm -hmm. um, oh, wow. we like, really we, like, like we said the previous times we were hoping for more story rather than fighting because the last six volumes mm -hmm. We're basically then just fighting the entire fighting, time. Fighting, fighting, fighting. So we met a whole bunch of new characters. Mm -hmm. One of the uh, the admirals, is it, from the mm -hmm. Navy? Mm -hmm. That guy, very, very cool. Mm -hmm. um, I wish that there was a little bit more about him, but I think he's probably going to show up. Um, in the I next feel like that, too. He's definitely um, going to have more of a presence in the book, I think, because he's going to have to. Well, obviously. Things are out of know, control. Know his name. We finished up with um, Afro Luffy fighting. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, and you know Anyone? what? You know what was crazy to me? That they were looking for a carpenter. And if they won, they would get anyone on their crew. Right. And what does that idiot do? Yeah. Ask for the flag. I'm with you on that. I actually sat there reading going, really, Luffy? I I, I was... All of that for a flag. Was that yeah. a need or a want on I his think behalf? He, I think he just wanted it. He could have just stolen it. I guess. He's a right, pirate. He's a pirate. But he, they needed that carpenter badly. Yeah, they did. But, uh, but he didn't even... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It, to my mind, it didn't make sense because that was their only mode of transportation. Yeah. So, and you have this fantastic goal. Yeah. It's not going to happen now. Exactly. So that made no sense to me why he did that. Me either. But. What do we know? Well, throughout the story, he, he should probably kick himself in the butt. Because I really feel like everything that led up to yeah. some of the things was because he made that decision himself. Right, right. And like we were saying, his name is Admiral A Al Kiji. Oh, I Al figured you know how to say that. Al, Al Kiji. No, I didn't know how to say that. Oh. <laughs> no, because you know how out. to pronounce. Like, right? the author's yeah. name, I'm over here, Ichi Wadi. You know, <laughs> I don't know what he is. Al Kiji. Yes. Um, so strong. I really want to see this guy fight. He did oh, fight wow. with... Um, mm hmm Luffy and Nico, not really Nico Robin. He kind of just froze her. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that was wild. But he kept warning the crew mm -hmm. that she was bad news, and we were just like, "Really? Yeah." Okay. Mm -hmm. But if you guys have been following our videos, we did say when Nico Robin joined the crew, we're still unsure of her. Right, and, and I, I was still unsure. I thought, I don't, I don't believe him. Mm -hmm. I think. I think for some reason he's trying to take her from them. Right. Because but, she really is an asset. She's actually very strong. Yeah. yeah um, and yeah. I feel like, obviously, every single character has gotten stronger. Mm -hmm. um, oh, absolutely. So I feel like she is an asset to the crew. However, in this story, we kind of get like a three... 365 turn on her like mm -hmm. completely different mm -hmm. she's she's not who we think we are well, right now well we don't know we kind of feel like right. she's i think there's we're so at a cliffhanger right there we're really at a cliffhanger definitely because when i got to the end of this i thought no i know i, I have to i know. really want to know what happens next who is she i'm reading it on my app and i can keep reading the chapters but i stopped i did not read okay, any more good, chapters good 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 because i was like i have to get the book for mrs rogers <laughs> first and then i'll start reading it yeah. it was so good i just kept, i could not stop i was like I, I know. And I read this over a period of days. Mm -hmm. I gave myself blocks of time to yeah. read, trying to do, stay alive. And, um, <laughs> <laughs> not really. And, um, I looked forward to reading this. Yeah. yeah. The, this, this, these volumes are mm -hmm. one of my favorite This and the ones. last one. I don't know about the one before that. 
The one was a lot of fighting. Yeah. <laughs> no, there's more depth to it. I, I like this storyline. Um, so they show up to mm-hmm. an island called Seven... Is it Seven? Water Seven. Water Seven, yes. yes. I had to repeat that umpteen times because I wanted to say Seven Water. Seven Water? Water Seven, water. yes. <laughs> and now they're in the position of a major flood from Laguna Water. Yeah. So the tide water, basically the city goes completely underwater. Right. So people have to go up on the hill. But that was at the end. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. So they get to this town. They meet these weird characters at, like, right before they go to this, this town. Okay. The little grandmother, the bunny, and the little girl. Okay. That grandmother? She's sketch. She yeah. sucks. She's yeah. real sucks. She's really... Well, I think she's an alcoholic. Oh, obviously. Clearly. The thing about it, it's though... Like, come on, Grandma. There were some events that led to um, Straw Hats, Luffy's crew, mm-hmm. being accused of doing something they didn't do. Mm-hmm. But I thought... Because, remember, their, their money was stolen. Mm-hmm. And then this guy ended up drinking with this lady mm-hmm. and she was like you really think that the pirates did that so i thought at first i thought she was bad but mm-hmm. i think she's actually a, like just a weird character i wonder if she's undercover maybe because she's she just her she's looks weird so face. exaggerated like this yeah. big. but the reason i think this too is that we've seen some characters that have costumes and face yes. masks yes so that made me think Wait a minute. Hmm. We don't know yet. Really, what does she know that she's not telling? Exactly. Is is she going to be a part of them getting their ship built? Oh, back? I hope so because they lost all their berries. Mm-hmm. So basically, they needed a carpenter, and like mm-hmm. we said, he took the flag instead. They get to this town, and they are basically told that the um, Mary. The Mary, yeah, the ship mm-hmm. is like done. Mary for. go, yeah. Mm-hmm. She can't set sail anymore. She's gonna go down. Like mm-hmm. they're surprised they even made it to the island. Right, and they were told it was irreparable by yeah. the, the major, yeah, like the master shipbuilders. Yeah, which I I gotta tell you, I even wondered, are you guys really telling them the truth? Yes. Now that, I'm suspicious that, of yeah. everybody. I am because there's so much going on in this story that I'm kind right. of like, are they, like, did they tell the truth? I know. And then this led to a fight with Usopp, who, oh. by the way, lost two million berries. Mm-hmm. So they're kind of at a standstill right now because they don't have the money for a new ship. Mm-hmm. They can't fix their ship right, right. now. And then Usopp and Luffy got into a fight with each other mm-hmm. over the merry-go because Usopp said, you know, you can't believe these guys. Mm-hmm. Right. So, so that's that's part of where I was coming from. Gosh, what does he know that we don't know? Right. Or that Luffy doesn't know. Mm-hmm. And then... But Luffy was done. Yeah. He was done with the merry-go. Yeah. He was. He was like, we're just going to have to get a new ship, blah, blah, blah. Mm-hmm. And then Yusuf was like, no, I'll fight you for it. Yeah, and I'm so going to the whole fight. That was actually, I was so genuinely surprised how uh, Yusuf was able to kind of stand on his own. I think that's a development in yeah. him as far as a character. Mm-hmm. I, don't, I wonder if he will be co-captain. Maybe. Because he's definitely... He's finally stood up for something of significance. Yes. And he's been willing to put himself on the line. Yeah. So we've always talked about the characters. Yeah. And I think that shows a real depth. In his character. Yeah. yeah. So, because we said all of the characters had something that they really stood for. He he was just kind of there. Yeah. Wishy-washy. So, yeah. Goofy. He was just doing nothing for them. Right. Like, contribute. Yeah. You know. So... This was actually kind of like an eye opener for him. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So that was that was a good character development on right. his behalf. And I think he's going to be more respected. Yeah. Because Typically. he actually like He stood up for something that mattered. Not exactly. Something that didn't matter, something that mattered to him. Yeah. So, so I'm wondering, like because we really were left at a cliffhanger. Oh totally. is he gonna go back to the crew? 
Is Robin going to go back to the crew? Oh my gosh, Robin. I don't know how they can trust her. And they want the truth. Yeah. They're searching for the truth. And at one point I was thinking, just stop. Just cut your losses. Get that ship and go Go what you're going to do. Yeah. And get to the Grand Line and let her do what she's going to do. Mm -hmm. Because it was a... It was an amazing turn of events. Yeah, it was. I mean, if... I guess if she is too much of a threat, maybe they need to deal with her. Um, Can they deal with her, though? That's the thing. Yeah. She is so intelligent. I know. And manipulative. Yeah. Yeah. And to me... Okay, I'll tell you. Years ago, <clears throat> when I was young, I was in mm -hmm. grade school... There was a man and his family, they lived a couple houses down from us, and he was an undercover detective. Oh. And he, because he was immersed in that environment, he literally became like that. He was so immersed in that, and they had four or five children, and they wound up getting divorced because he became part of that, and he didn't know how to go back to family. Mm-hmm wife, children. It was like two different worlds for him. Wow. Yeah. So you, you maybe know, has she gone to that point? Right. Cause like even she said you guys, um, she said I didn't deserve that kind of mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. So there's a lot going on with her. Yes. I really, really like her character though. Mm -hmm. Um actually a very interesting character. I wanna know the truth. I just I want to know what is the truth. I want to cheat and go on you Google, go, yeah, and I want to cheat, it. but I refuse to cheat. Yes, don't cheat. It's bad. Right. So um, we met the mayor of um, water, seven water seven water, water seven water seven. Ah, <laughs> uh, I did the same thing. Um, a very well respected man. Yes. Um, the whole town loved him. Yes. And um, we find out that he's got blueprints to mm -hmm. a ship. Is it a ship? I believe so. I think it's a so. ship. It's just that it would be... A ship like none other. Yes. And it would be the best ship ever. Like major... Like, okay, it, it, like our son's in the Navy, so mm -hmm. I'm thinking like a war destroyer, yeah, warship yeah. type thing. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Whoa. So, um, Nico Robin supposedly is undercover. She is an agent with the intelligence agency. Mm -hmm. um, Mask. Cake, yeah, everything. Very secretive. Yeah. But then there were other characters. I'm like, you! I knew, you! I knew I thought, that the mayor's secretary had to be undercover. Why did you think that? Because, okay, so... I thought um, she was very unassuming. Just no, did See, the that's bedding. why. That's why. Oh, okay. So, she, it's the she perfect... She sucked me in? Yeah, it's the perfect opportunity to get all the information that you need. That's that true. She was with him all the time. That's true. She knew his entire schedule. She knew when he ate, when he went to meetings, when he woke up, when he went to sleep. Mm -hmm. She knew everything. So. Perfect spy. Yeah, exactly. Didn't even go there in my mind. Yeah, that's where oh. I went. I was just like, I'm real suspicious. Because at first, <laughs> I thought that she was the one that had shot him. I was like. Oh, yeah. At first, but the, I then I you, thought, why would you do that? You Well, see, because I was suspicious of her. Suspicious. I was oh. real suspicious. Oh. And then the talking bird dude, I was like, that Cuckoo guy, or come Cuckoo on. Or yeah. Whatever. I thought, yeah, I was like, this guy's suspicious too. But not in the way that it ended up being. I just thought he was odd. He was odd. It was weird. But I didn't. Kind of I had, just thought he was he odd. He had a pigeon so or a bird, and the it bird. did the talking? Yeah, the bird did the talking instead of the dude. It was like, they, what, compared it to vent That's ventriloquism? What we <laughs> ventriloquism? Yeah, yeah. But, I don't know, the bird really had a personality and I know everything. It, did. it was a real bird, too. Mm -hmm. So, okay. it wasn't a parrot. What was it? It was, I don't know, but it was a bird. A specific kind of bird, probably an imaginary yeah. bird. <laughs> and it flew and everything. <laughs> <laughs> whatever art the author wanted. Yeah. Whatever creative thing came up in his mind. Right. So, 
Yeah, so yeah, that's why I thought the secretary was suspicious. Because mm. I was like, there's no way that this, like, you would work just because you, like, had so much respect for this guy. There's See, no way. well, and I thought maybe she was hoping that maybe they might develop a relationship okay. and get married because he would see her worth. And she, you know, they knew each other so well. Well, when um, she was presented as his beautiful secretary, I was like, yeah, I went, okay. really? I was like, okay, mm -hmm. like there's more to this chick than just being a secretary. That's what I that, thought. That's what I, and then um, I don't know if you noticed, but this was before like it was really brought up. The mayor had a picture of Nico Robin in his room. Yeah. Okay. And I thought, what's wrong with you? Yeah. I was like, um, well, maybe not what's wrong with you. I was like, are you, you in love but, with this girl? Yeah. What? You don't hang up a picture of somebody. Yeah. Without a reason. Yeah. I think she was <clears> worth, <throat> what, 70 million berries? I don't know. You know, the more berries you're worth. But see, then I thought, is that a daughter? Is that a relation? But I guess that there's a backstory and we don't know about it know. because he didn't say anything about right. it. So um, basically, they're trying to the, these agents. Mm -hmm. They're trying to get these blueprints. Mm -hmm. But why are they trying to get it? Are they wanting to build that ship? That's what my takeaway was. Okay, that this is going to be a ship like none other, and if you have it. You're basically control of the universe. Yeah, the power is unlimited. I was hoping that Luffy would get it, and then he would make, the, he would get the ship and get the well, ship. Well, Luffy's pretty crafty, right. but I don't know where he would get the funds, the money, yeah, the berries he, to do it. They He's, lost all the money thanks to Usopp. Thank and, you. But in in all fairness to Usopp, he was heartbroken and devastated for the choice that he made. Yeah. So character to genuinely follow. okay i'll I give him know. i'll give him that i'll give him that okay um i was pretty mad when he lost the i know I was, I was like irritated. you are so ridiculous right. How, you're so oh you had one job but you know even though he cried and he wept and he mourned over mm -hmm. that he still could do it again yeah unless he's truly sorry mm -hmm. because i used to tell my kids if you say you're sorry, that means you won't do it again. Oh, you and I talked about yeah. this with kids. Yeah. And and that's supposed to be what that means. Yeah. I won't do it again. But then they still do it. So. Yeah, they do. It's a learning curve for exactly. children. Yeah. This is, this yeah. is a man This character. is an adult. He's an adult. Right. So, um, oh, they have one weird dude that took the money. What's his name? Can't remember his name, but he had a weird star on his forehead, right? Yeah. Where it was over, like... So are they cyborgs too? Because the dude with the cyborg arms, why like, would well, he was a cyborg? He had stars. Does it make sense to have just one cyborg? Right? How could you just only one? You right. would need multiple cyborgs. Mm -hmm. And who's making these cyborgs is the real question. Well, so now I'm thinking about the ship and this uh -huh. amazing ship. Yeah. Questions. That we will hopefully have in the next we'll volume. some answers. Well, we need the answers mm -hmm. because right now we're kind of at a standstill because right. we don't know if uh, Nico Robin's going to go back. We right. don't know if she's going to, like, if the mayor's going to die. Right. By the way, the Straw Hats were the ones accused of um, shooting the um, mayor mm -hmm. because, of course, they're pirates. They would do something like that. Mm -hmm. Um, and because they just happened to go see the mayor right. around a certain time and so people were like, looks, it's obvious right yeah. So, um, we... I'm, I'm really surprised the mayor hasn't died. Me too. I thought he would I be mean, dead by now. Like, I, I thought he yeah. was dead yesterday when right. I read the book. But then, could he be a cyborg? Oh. Under flesh. You know? I don't know. Mm -hmm. We need answers. So we do. So now we're at Luffy got captured. Yes. The mayor is captured. The agents, the secret intelligence agents, there's four, four or five of them. Mm -hmm. Four of them. Um, I think there's five. There's five. They're all trying to get the information from the mayor. 
so they can get the blueprints. But supposedly they already have the blueprints, and the mayor told them mm -hmm. they're not the real ones. Yeah, now they're fake, but that's what they're being told. Yeah. So, um, and of course, these people <clears throat> that are the agents have been working side by side with the mayor, so they know him, they know mm -hmm. his attitude, his personality, so they know everything about him. Mm -hmm. So, they're kind of putting him to the test right. when they checked his pulse, and that one character... That's very clever. Yeah, that very clever. one character was like, mm -hmm. well, I'm going to check your pulse because... You know, we have these blueprints, and we know that you do this, you do that, and I would, we would know mm -hmm. if you had already picked somebody else. Unless you are the calmest, coolest character, mm -hmm. your your body is going to react to what's right. asked of you. You would know that. Cause yeah. Miss Joe's almost an R N. Well, but what if he's putting on the show? I know. See, and that's what, that's what uh, I thought. I was man. like, what if he's like get making himself nervous? But what if that guy was lying and his pulse really wasn't? Oh, and maybe he's working. I don't. I don't know. Oh my gosh. There's so many ways that the story could go, but we don't have concise answers. So there's different. There's. I'm thinking that the mayor is putting on a show. And is making it seem like he's nervous so that they think that they actually have them and leave them alone. But if they have the blue planes, they're supposed to kill him. Right. So. I think the mayor is something. The mayor's in there somehow. Yeah. I think the mayor Nobody is very is like. Seem they he's are. very level headed. Yeah. Right. And I think that he's got more tricks up his sleeve than we think. I think he is highly intelligent. Yeah. Yeah, so we won't find out the answers okay. until the next time. This really, I enjoyed this book. Yeah, this one was definitely wow. like a 20 out of yeah. 10 because it was good. And I think it's the plot yeah, and the characters. Yeah, the plot is thickening. Right, right. So we, I feel like there's more substance. Yeah. You know. Yeah, there's more than just fighting, which I feel like, the, I think he probably fought put all the fighting in there to kind of put a filter in for a while oh so that he could come up with something something yeah. different, something grandiose, right. Right. which he did. This is so cool. Yeah. This, this is, is really, really cool. Good. This is really good. Yeah. 10 out of 10, highly recommend oh, yeah. this. You guys have to read yeah. this. Yeah. Or watch the anime. There is like a thousand episodes. So you'd be really, really busy watching it. Mm -hmm. So tune in next time. Yep. Yeah. We are going to find out the answers to this. Mm -hmm. We so, hope. Well, I hope so. Yeah. I would hope we so. We better. I want to know what Nico Robin is planning. I want to know if Usopp is coming back. And I want to know if the Mary Go will survive or if it will not survive. Or they're going to make a new one and have some parts of the Mary Go. Which it's, would be a great thing to do, but they don't have the money. I think this would be, be the perfect time for Usopp to become a pirate of his own ship. You and I can. I think he just well, maybe fits I'm in just so letting well. my imagination work. I, I think he fits so it. well with the straw hats. He does. He does. He does. So no, but we, it would be the perfect time for them to split. Yeah. You know. Shoot, I don't know. I don't know. I would like him to go back, or part of me just doesn't want to see him back. But we'll see. Mm -hmm. We will see in the next three volumes of One Piece. Thanks for tuning in, guys, and make sure to listen to BTS's new song, Permission to Dance. Bye! Did we listen to that? No, we have not. Oh, darn it. I will let okay. you listen after. <laughs> okay. Bye! Bye.